Ooh, look, corn. It's corn. It's corn. Really? What? Go let the ducks out. Who? Go. Who? I want to see your pumpkins. Who? 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 Let Here, the ducks two out. pumpkins. A what? Here, two Seminole pumpkins. Uh, two Seminole pumpkins. Huh? I had the big selfie stick out. This one here, that one there, this one here, this one here. All those? Are those the two you were talking about? Or are you just talking about these two that just came on early over here? Okay, this is the duck yard. These are the two pumpkin plants. There's supposed to be only two. This is the duck yard. It's very um, small at the moment. Yeah, they're not. They're not. They've not been allowed into the corn for a while, and so they've been obliged to eat nothing but duck feed. And they don't like eating duck feed. It turns out. Yep. Okay. Who knew? Boo. Hi, you want to make some fertilizer? Make some fertilizer. Oh, I think Ernie was right. How many times can you say <laughs> manure? She said poop. Manure. Poop. All right. Whenever it starts. Oh, God. Whenever, whenever it back starts. Up. <laughs> yeah, okay, go ahead. Okay. No splashy. So, so, let's see. This was, this is brand new yesterday. And it's all muddy. They get it muddy in the course of a couple hours. This is the day before yesterday. It's not green yet. Whenever it turns green, that means that the urea has been converted by the by the, the geobacter and nitrobacter into nitrite and then into nitrate. This takes place a lot faster in an aqueous environment than it does in the soil. It happens Please? in soil too. The same bacteria are in soil. So whenever you're doing regular compost, that same sort of uh, transformation takes place. But it happens a lot faster in an aqueous environment because the bacteria can move around easily in the water. Aqueous is another word for water? Yes. Aqua. Aqua. Ooh. See, it's green. <laughs> this is why we have the long selfie stick. <laughs> oh. It's green. But if it sits here for a minute, it'll turn red. What? It'll... Why would it turn red? Well, have a look. Huh? Have a look. It's not green anymore. It's because we stirred up the mud. Oh. <laughs> the mud. Yes, that's the word. Mud. So that's going to be the fresh water? So this gets diluted to make fertilizer. You did turn on the water, right? Yeah. Oh. Well, there's a smell. <laughs> And these are the weeds I've been collecting. Weeds. Uh, these are the unwanted plants that I've been collecting and harvesting for their biomass. To get them to break down rapidly, turn into soil. Just put our excess from the duck ponds in there. There we go. What's that duck bait? I wouldn't be in here for you. We let the ducks out. Okay. Now all I gotta do is fill this back up. 15 gallons of water every day goes to those duckies. Those buckets there, we'll go ahead and mix them up so they're diluted four to one. So we'll wind up with 20 gallons of liquid fertilizer every day out of those buckets. Do you actually put them out every day? No, not every day. Sometimes I save them up and do it like all at once. Really? You saved duck poo. <laughs> yeah. Well, if, if, if this water is not turned green by the time we get to day four, then I just hold it in the bucket until it does turn green. Because oh, I don't want to put point. it out there as fertilizer until the bacteria do the job of turning that urea into nitrate. Ah, uh, good point, good point. Otherwise, I'm just putting urea out. 
which is fine. You can put out urea and the, well. the bacteria in the soil will convert it into nitrate and then you'll, your plants will get fed. Or you can wait until it converts to nitrate and then just apply it. So it's probably safer to wait, right? You don't want to just pee on your plant. Yeah, but if you've got a third of an acre, about three or four ducks would be enough. You got a little too many, I guess. Then we, yeah, well, we've got we've got eight. I need to reduce the number down to about maybe six. So if we can get over six. that what we're having for Thanksgiving? Duck. <laughs> uh, no, these are these are still fairly young ducks, so I'll probably wind up giving two or three of them away to somebody hmm. in the neighborhood. These ducks. Need ducks. <laughs> it's like you need another hole in your head. But you make a lot of eggs. Do you have a fertilizer factory? <laughs> oh, oh, not that kind of. Oh, I'll put that gruesome artichoke I mean, in there. Keep the in video mind, here. all this stuff is being grown without commercial fertilizer. It's being grown with duck poop for duck the most poop. part. Yep. Yeah. Yep. It works. <laughs> it pumpkin. works really good. Yeah, those pumpkins. Yeah, we're gonna look at those pumpkins. Yeah, so you see there's no pumpkins in here. Let me find a place. Oh, there's one. There's another one. But I not, missed that one. But they're not in. But the pumpkins aren't in the duck yard, if you notice. But they're in the corn. Oh, corn 